Two Works For You Sports, sponsored by your Oklahoma Ford dealers. What's going on, everybody? Welcome into sports. The first college football Saturday of November is here. OU on their bye week, so we got OSU and TU. We start with the Cowboys coming off that upset win over Iowa State last weekend. Could they keep that momentum going today against TCU? To Stillwater we go. Mike Gundy confirming to the ESPN broadcast crew that Tylen Wallace will miss the remainder of the season with a torn ACL tough loss for the Pokes. First quarter, OSU already up 3-0 on a field goal. Spencer Sanders escaping the pocket, slinging one to Dylan Stoner for a 57-yard TD pass. That makes it 10-0 Pokes. And with Trey Sterling out today, the safety group had to step up, and they did. Colby Harvell Peel intercepting Max Duggan here in the second quarter. Then a couple drives later, it's Sanders, again, connecting with Stoner. And look at the catch in the back of the end zone. Nicely done by the Jinx native. Well, with Wallace out, he has stepped up big time. Three receptions, 93 yards, two scores today. It was 17-7 at the half. Then we hear from Chuba Hubbard. Under eight minutes left to go. Third quarter, Hubbard would not be touched. He goes 92 yards for the score to give OSU the lead, 24-17. Pistol Pete, loving that. Then how about Wagner native Malcolm Rodriguez named the Big 12 Player of the Week this past week after 11 tackles in that game-winning pick six against Iowa State. He intercepts Duggan here, and he continues to play well. Fourth quarter, Chuba Hubbard, he doesn't stop. He doesn't care. 62-yard touchdown run for the Canadian. He now has the eighth most rush yards in a single season in OSU history. He gives the Pokes. 31-17 lead. They go on to win 34-27 the final. Spencer Sanders, 9-15, 158 passing yards, two touchdowns, one interception. Chuba Hubbard, 223 yards on the ground, two touchdowns. 